being able to curate such a place is just something I never thought possible. We were launching the first exhibit of 10. This one is titled Walking With Our History, MICEC Through the Years. I was initially hired on as a summer student and eventually I was brought on for the collections team, which was a project that began as documenting every single piece of artwork that we own in this center. And that was a journey that we initially thought was only going to take a few months. It ended up taking the better part of a year and a half. And once we had it all cataloged, we wanted to figure out something to do with it. I thought I would come check out the center. You know, it's been closed for the past three years. And so I'm finally excited that, you know, it's finally open to the public again. I think it's important because you know, we need somewhere, you know, where we can, uh, you know, learn about our culture, you know, our languages, our history. And I feel like this place is the, probably like one of the best embodiments of that. So I've spent so much of my time knowing, getting to know this entire collection so intimately that I appreciate it all so much that I can't pick just one. So the fact that I'm actually able to do this and do it with Indigenous art, something I hold so dear to me. To show our art and to have other people celebrate that, I think is just a celebration of our hearts just as much as it is what we create. MICEC is back and we're so excited to have you. <laughs>